So good morning. Today is uh, Wednesday, November 11. I was walking my dog and I realized that uh, one of my neighbors had this a tender cactus plant that actually had this insect. It is called a scale. So these white protuberances are actually it's, it's a material that the insect secretes to be able to protect itself from the environment or predators, for example. So uh, they have these mouth parts that get in inside the tender cactus, the cactus, and they start getting the sap. And that's how they feed. What is very interesting is that this plant is originally from Mexico. And you can see that if I take this, um, this thing or the insect, you'll see how you, I mean, how about there. It's a little blurry, but you can see all this color, this red color um, in pre-Hispanic times or the Aztecs and uh, indigenous cultures. They still use it, they use it as a, as a paint. And they're like, a, it's a very vivid red color they mix it with other material to actually for the color to last and that's how they painted a lot of the actually uh, buildings or uh, even their clothes so they use this insect this call a scale it's kind of like a insect that has very interesting um, adaptation which is like it doesn't have anything just a small body and mouth parts and they just basically uh, the adults they fly and then when they land they air the eggs the most of the insects they don't have anything else not even legs they just have a, a, a body and mouth parts uh, parts of the body and mouth parts and that's how they they fit but what is interesting is how humans we have been talking about like how humans use cotton how humans use uh, uh, wool but this is another kind of uh, insects have been part of the of the use of of material too